you want to learn more about Google's lead generation, well, in this video, I'm going to show you the exact process that I use and that other people use in order to actually get leads from Google. I'm going to explain how you can get leads and then, of course, how you can apply that to your business because there's different ways you can actually get leads. Uh, the most important thing that you need to understand is that people go to Google to actually find businesses in most cases. In a lot of cases, they actually go and they research things through Google. So you have to know exactly how to target people properly. Because if you don't target them properly, then you're going to get a lot of people that are uninterested on your website and then you're just going to waste a lot of money. So targeting and understanding your customer is going to be crucial you know, in pretty much any kind of marketing, but especially when it comes to Google's lead generation. So aside from targeting, you need to also understand exactly how you can actually show your business to people. So you can show it by getting a Google My Business listing, which is completely free, by... Uh, ranking your listing by optimizing your website for SEO and stuff so that your listing can actually show up high on Google when people search for your services. So unless you're actually using SEO to rank on Google and to show up when people search for your services automatically, you actually have to pay Google in order to get leads. Now, some ads are more effective than others, but the most common ads that you see are going to be search ads or PPC ads. With PPC ads, you basically compete with other businesses and you're trying to pay Google more money to show your ads higher. Of course, if your ad is higher, then people are going to notice your ad more. And even though the bid itself is not going to be the most important factor, it's still going to be one of the most important factors, of course. Aside from PPC ads or Google search ads, you also have local services ads or Google guaranteed ads. And you probably heard about these as well, but previously they were only available in bigger cities. But right now they're actually available in a lot of cities in the United States. So definitely check those out if you want to get some really affordable, high quality leads. And local services ads or Google guaranteed ads uh, works in a similar way that SEO does for small businesses, where you try to show your listing higher on Google while local services ads kind of advertise your listing. Not exactly, but you know, I guess that would be the best metaphor that I could use. So now I'm gonna show you the exact process that somebody uses in order to actually find contractors or different businesses on Google so that you can better understand how Google's lead generation strategy works. So I wanna show you the whole process that somebody goes through when they're actually finding contractors. Now, whether you're a modeler, landscaper, or pretty much anything else, the same process is gonna work for you as well. People are going to go to Google and then they're going to type in remodeling contractor near me or landscaper near me or something similar. First, they're going to see these Google guaranteed ads, which are available in a lot of different cities in the United States. And then when they scroll down, they're going to see these three businesses from their local area. Now you need to pay for leads in order to show up here in this spot, but this spot here is completely free. All you need is a website and a Google My Business listing, which you can get completely for free. Now, of course, in order to actually rank and get in this place, you probably need to hire an SEO specialist like myself to help you build a website, optimize it for SEO, optimize your Google My Business listing, and do all those different things. But once you actually start ranking here, maintaining your position is gonna be a lot simpler. And then, of course, you can easily get a lot of high quality but affordable leads. But again, getting here is going to be really, really difficult. But the good thing is that you don't actually have to get into these top three spots. A lot of people are going to click on more businesses, especially when they search for remodelers, for example. When people are looking for less expensive services, then they're not really going to care that much. So they're just going to go to Google, search for, for example, lawn mowing near me, and they're going to find a company that has a lot of reviews, click on that company, give them a call, see if they're available and all that. But a lot of people that are actually looking to invest more money, for example, somebody who's looking to remodel their bathroom or remodel their kitchen is going to go and they're going to click on more businesses. When they click on more businesses, they're going to be able to see a lot more businesses from their local region. And as you can see, all these businesses from Phoenix, Arizona are getting leads. Some of them are getting more leads than others, of course, but a lot of them are getting excellent results, even though they're not actually first on Google. Now, of course, you want to get as high as possible. And there's a lot of different factors that Google actually looks at when they're determining like which businesses they should actually show at the top. But the good thing is that you don't actually have to pay. Like with Google ads, you usually have to compete on a price. So somebody who's willing to spend more is going to be placed higher on Google. And the same thing works for landscapers as well. They're going to see a lot of these local landscapers in their area, of course. This is basically the essence of Google's lead generation. The reason why I prefer local pack and the reason why I prefer SEO is because it offers a much better return on investment than, for example, Google ads. I also like Google guaranteed ads, but this mainly depends on your business, of course, and what kind of leads you're actually looking for. And also another important thing that you need to know is the fact that Google business listings are connected to your Google Guaranteed profiles. So when you create a new Google Guaranteed account, they will actually search for your Google business profile 
And then all the reviews that you actually have on your Google Business Profile will be connected to your Google Guaranteed account. The reason why this is so important is because the listings who have a lot more reviews are gonna get a lot more attention and therefore they're gonna get better results with their Google Guaranteed ads. The two crucial things that you should definitely focus on if you're trying to get leads is Google My Business Listing and your website because those two things are going to be crucial. First of all, even if you're running PPC ads or Google search ads or any kind of ads, you're sending people somewhere and in most cases you're sending them to your website. So if your website sucks, if your website copy isn't good, if you don't show your work on your website, if you don't properly convince people that they should work with you instead of your competitors, then of course your PPC ads are not going to be as effective. And it pretty much goes the same way for pretty much any other marketing strategy. You need to have a proper sales page that explains why people should work with you instead of somebody else. And in most cases, the website is the best place where we can add all that info. Um, so definitely you need to have a good website. But aside from having a good website that actually helps convert website visitors into actual customers, you also need to have a website that's optimized for SEO because that's gonna help your business show up on Google when people search for your services. Now, of course, it's gonna be really difficult for me to explain any of this stuff in this one video. I have a lot of different videos on my YouTube channel, so definitely go and check those out if you wanna see more. But if you wanna work with me and my team, or if you need an advice, go to my website, logicalmarketer.net. I'll leave a link in the description, of course. Uh, feel free to send me uh, any questions through that website. So yeah, uh, basically, you need a website and it needs to be optimized for SEO if you're trying to get leads for your business. I mean, sure, you can go without doing these two, but it's such a waste of potential. And if you're a contractor, you definitely need a Google My Business listing because it allows it to show up above regular search results and below ads, but it's a really effective way to actually get a lot of leads because most people, when they search for contractors or different kinds of small businesses, this is gonna be the main place that they actually look at. And I'm gonna show you like the local pack here as well. So yeah, this is basically how Google's lead generation works and how people actually get leads through Google. And of course, this is the same process that I use for a lot of different businesses as well. And if you want to learn more or if you have any questions, then go to logicalmarketer.net website. Again, link is in the description, but that's pretty much it for this video. If you liked it, definitely leave a like. If you have any questions, again, leave a comment maybe. But if you want to see more of these kind of videos, then definitely subscribe as well. Thank you for watching this video and have a great day.